Okay, calculus, we're going to look at homework 6.2. Um, you're going to be doing numbers 1 to 10 on page um, 420. And I wanted to go through number 7 with you just to show you how your answer might look different than the back of the book. So you're asked to solve the differential equation, which is going to mean to give a general solution. So we start off with y prime equals the square root of x times y. We substitute y prime for dy dx. We're going to separate our variables. We're going to multiply both sides by dx and divide both sides by y. All right, and then we're going to integrate both sides. So once we integrate both sides, we're going to have the ln of y equals 2 thirds x to the 3 halves plus c. You're going to switch that to an exponential. So e to the 2 thirds x to the 3 halves plus c equals the absolute value of y. Now, because they didn't give you an ordered pair, your textbook is going to leave off the plus or minus. So the first thing you'll notice with the textbook is that there's no plus or minus. And then they wrote their answer in a different way. Um, what they've done is they took apart um, this exponent. We know that when you multiply like bases together, you add your exponents together. So this is what we have. And then we know that e to the c is just a constant. Oops, learn how to spell here. So that just becomes our c. They're going to put that out in front. The final thing that you'll notice is that um, when they wrote their exponent, they wrote 2x to the 3 halves over c. Not over c, sorry, um, over 3. Okay, so this is their final solution. Now, I will forewarn you guys, um, you guys that are taking the AP test, um, they like to throw these in as short answer um, with a slope field, and you have got to be very careful that you write this as an exponent, and that things are expo that are exponents truly are raised and up in the air and smaller and so forth. So make sure your handwriting is not sloppy. They have to be able to read that you have an exponent there and so forth. So be super careful. All right, that is it on number seven.